Hi everyone, it's Mike, and in this video I'm going to make some more music in Logic Pro. This time I'm going to use VPS Avenger 2. Okay, so I'm just going to check if I can turn down the gain. Yeah, so I can do the master gain. I'm going to do minus 6 dB, like I did with Nexus yesterday. And uh, let's record in a melody. Let me, actually, let me find a cool sound first. Okay, I like that one. Let's record something in. Okay, let's just quantize it and I'm going to add a bass next. Okay, something a bit more gentle. Maybe that. Let's try that. Okay, let's quantize and let's filter some other highs. Okay, let's um, go to a different section. The next one, I'm going to put a different bass in. Okay, let's quantize and copy and then new track I'm gonna go to a drum so let's go new initialize yes drums and then let's choose a cool drum kit let's go for deep tech so mute OSC one turn off drum SQ okay let's try a different kit Let's turn off this filter. Okay, let's just record something in. Okay, just a basic beat. Let's maybe change the drum kit. Okay, let's add a um, epic. So we've got to have something filtering in there. Let's go for a pluck. Okay, let's maybe go to one of the expansions, like the collection. Uh, let's try this duty one. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
filter it down and then in. Gonna remove that drum from the end. Let's look for a cool effect sound. This is all time. Let's just try adding that into this section. quite like that. Uh, let's quantize and maybe make it a bit quieter. Let's just start naming these tracks so, so it's kind of an RP plot thing. Bass 1, this is bass 2, this was, I can't remember. <laughs> oh yeah, like a melody one. Effects. Drums. Okay, and then let's add a piano next. I think that will be cool. Um, so let's go to factory instruments. Is there a piano? Factory 2. <clears throat> uh, I'm sure I've used pianos. Oh, there we go. There's a whole piano category. Uh, this one. Something a bit brighter. A bit higher. Turn off the filter. Okay, I'm going to step record in at the piano melody. Say eight bars. I'm going to rename it to piano and change that to pointer. Double click. Step record on. Playhead in the right place. And Struggling to see the keys because of the microphone pop shield. <laughs> Let's just get rid of the wrong note. Okay, I quite liked the little step down, so I'm going to leave it like that. Let's rename that to piano. And let's filter it in. Let's add the epic, why not? Let's go to the beginning of the bar and filter it in. Okay, yeah, let's... Um, add a cool melody in the background, something kind of filtered out uh, a bit like RP. What's nostalgic? -o. Well, that's quite nice actually, let's go for that one. Let's call it swirly melody. I don't know. Let's quantize and then let's um, 
like fade it in. Okay, I think it's too far, too far filtered. Let's go back. Yeah, nice. Let's change this epic to space because it sounds a bit more atmospheric. I want to add a, like a, a deep bass there. Something a bit more dramatic than that. Let's go for the, oh, maybe the big boss, but like really filtered. Yeah, I think that'll work. Let's go. I think it's working. Let's just turn down the volume a bit of the bass. Um, Yeah, okay. Now let's go for a sequence in Avenger. And let's bring this piano back, maybe. Or should I change the piano? Because I don't want it to be too repetitive. Um, whoop, what's going on there? Okay, new piano track. Uh, filter off. Okay, so something a bit more choppy with gaps in it. Okay. Ties. Let's find a sequence. Um, what's chart pop bap? Okay, let's turn the octave down. Uh, driving techno. It's a bit too harsh. Shall we try that? Drive in techno too. Okay, so let's put it in time. Quantize. Oh, I can see a funny note there. Let's remove it. Okay, that's gone. Uh, we want to add a bit more life to the drum. So let's take kick only off. Let's add a ride. Let's give that a try. Okay, I think it's getting there. Let's just see if I can change that to an eighth note. Is that better? Let's just change that note. Where is it? to there. Okay, I like it. It's a bit crunchy. I think it's too loud, isn't it? It's peaking up there. So let's just turn it down. I think the crunchiness is intentional. Oh, actually, let's turn off this epic as well. It's probably um, causing it to peak a bit more. I feel 
like it does kind of work. Let's try a different one. And we'll come back to it if not. So I quite like that one. Let's mark it as a favourite. Then we can... Yeah. Okay, let's try number three. Like it. Let's try some more. Mm. Well, that's got a nice little groove to it. I like that one. Let's try this one. That works as well, I think. But let's try this one. Let's add hi hats. I think that's got the right vibe for this this track. Maybe let's add uh, some of this swirly melody in again. Okay, let's just turn down that high. Okay, let's add another RP thing. Oh, let's take that off record and do. Oh, it's still on record. Okay, let's try that. Okay, I quite like it. Let's quantize. Let's check out the notes. I think maybe there was a funny note in there somewhere. Let's have a listen to it on its own. Okay, 16th note. There it was. Cool, yeah, I like it. So uh, I'm gonna do the thing where I add a kickstart to everything apart from the sequence, um, just to see how it sounds. So let's make a new RP pluck track. Let's add this one up here. Let's add the swirly melody up here. Uh, this is the sequence. Let's rename it to sequence because it says piano and that's very confusing. Let's go and select all these tracks um, for this section. So that's the only things on it. And I'm going to right click, create track stack, create swimming stack. We're going to call it kickstart. We're going to add kickstart to and then we're going to have a, <clears throat> excuse me, we're going to have a listen back to the music. Cool, I like it. Let's maybe add that riser again because it sounded nice. Okay, I'm going to have faith that that'll sound nice and I'm going to listen to the whole thing back from the beginning. So let's have a listen. Let's press Z to see all the tracks. There we go. Uh, and let's press play.
cool. I'm quite happy with that. I think it sounds nice. Um, I'd probably add more things um, and maybe like this is a bit of a strong contrast so maybe add like an effect going into that uh, and yeah I think it sounds quite nice. What do you think? Did you like it? Hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked this one you might like the one I recorded yesterday which was um, doing the same thing but with Nexus 4 um, so have a look at my channel. Uh, I'll try and link the video to this video. Um, so yeah, let me know if you enjoyed it. Could you subscribe if you like this channel? Um, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you. Bye.